All right, so we're going to solder on our connector here. A lot of people just like to crimp them, but uh, here we like to solder them to ensure that no matter what, the connection's always going to be solid. So we're just going to heat up the ring terminal here. This is a 5 16 ring terminal, four gauge ground cable. Each individual amp will have its own ground cable. It's going to heat up the actual ring of the, uh, the terminal, and we're going to fill up this area here with solder. I like to call it the pot. So we're going to fill the pot up here with solder. It takes quite a bit of solder here to get the pot full, but Let's continue filling the pot. Take it away from the heat and continue filling it up until it's nice and full. You'll see it start to drip out there. And that's it. Let that cool off and uh, that'll be one solid connection that's never going to come apart. All right, now that uh, I've got that ground connection all made right there, I'm actually going to drill a hole into the body of the vehicle. As you can see, I've got the, uh, the ground all grounded down. And we're going to be using a nut and a bolt and a couple of washers through the body. A lot of guys like using, again, like they like using, you know, self-tappers or things like that. Not the way to go. The best way to do it is a bolt just directly through the body. So I'll get that all done up and I'll go from there. All right, now that we get that bolted in, same thing with the underside, as you can see right there. And I'm just going to shoot that with a quick uh, thing of black paint. All right, so now I'm just going to hit this with a little bit of silver paint. Stop it from rusting.